You may have heard of the term higher self, especially if you tune into law of attraction topics on YouTube or, you know, just on the internet in general or anywhere for that matter. Simply put, the higher self is like your inner spiritual guru or wise one. It's the part of you that's beyond the physical body and beyond the, the ego. Think of it as your own personal guide that's connected to a bigger, universal, more complete consciousness. Um, the higher self is all about intuition, wisdom and love. This EFT tapping session is designed to help you access your higher self with greater ease. Welcome and welcome back to Self Care Karen. Self Care Karen is all about empowering busy women to feel their best and to give their best. I'm going to link my EFT playlist here. Hopefully you'll be able to access it. If not, it will be, there'll be a link in the video description. So you can check out my other tapping videos. I'm gonna jump straight into the tapping sequence today. So if you want to know a little bit more about me, about um, my brand, including the EFT products that I offer, like custom um, scripts, uh, pre-written scripts, custom videos, then just take a look at the video description. EFT is a really effective way of working through your limiting beliefs and really um, unboxing those emotional blocks that you might have and experiencing freedom that's why it's called emotional freedom um, and giving you the ability to build thought patterns that are really going to enable you to live your best life a key part of my self journey has been to better understand this talking therapy and to become a certified eft practitioner so how can EFT help you gain easier access to your higher self? That part of you that is wise, that part of you that is intuitive. By using tapping techniques, you can actually release any kind of emotional block that you might have, clear out the limiting beliefs and really get rid of all that mental chatter that keeps you from hearing your higher self's wisdom. It's like giving your inner guru a direct line of communication to you. EFT helps you quiet the noise, find clarity and connect to that higher realm of insight and guidance. It's all about creating that open channel to access your higher self's wisdom and bring into your everyday life that intuition and that wisdom of your higher self. So let's get started. Just do what I do and repeat what I say. Please make sure that you're somewhere safe and quiet. Somewhere where you can just take time to focus on your emotions, on how you're feeling. And let's start by just taking a few deep breaths just to calm your mind and to center yourself. And as always, we're gonna begin by acknowledging where we are in our journey here with our higher self. And we're gonna start with the karate chop. Empower yourself through self-care. Okay, let's start with the karate chop. Even though I sometimes struggle to connect with my higher self, I deeply and completely accept myself and choose to tap into the wisdom of my higher self with ease and clarity. Even though I may doubt my ability to access my higher self, I honor my inner guidance and open myself to receiving its wisdom. Even though I may have had challenges connecting with my higher self in the past, 
I release any resistance now and choose to create a strong and effortless connection to its wisdom. Let's move to the eyebrow. I'm ready to connect with my higher self. (sighs) Side of eye. Releasing any doubts or fears about accessing its wisdom. (sighs) Under eye. Opening myself to receive clear guidance and insight. (sighs) Under nose. I release any blocks or limitations that hinder my connection. Chin. I am open and receptive to my higher self's wisdom. Collarbone. Allowing the flow of intuitive guidance into my awareness. Underarm, releasing any resistance to connecting with my higher self. Top of head, I trust in the wisdom and clarity of my higher self. Eyebrow. I release any distractions or mental clutter. Side of eye. Clearing my mind to create space and for higher guidance. Under eye. Tuning into the subtle whispers of my higher self. under nose, allowing its wisdom to permeate my thoughts and decisions, chin, I am open to receiving divine insights and inspiration, (sighs) collarbone, Embracing the guidance of my higher self with ease. Underarm. I'm releasing any need for validation or proof. Top of head. I trust that my higher self's wisdom is always available to me. Eyebrow. I release any fear of making the wrong choices. Just release that. Side of eye. Embracing the guidance of my higher self as my compass. Under eye. Trusting that I am always on the right path. (sighs) Under nose. I choose to connect deeply to my higher self. (sighs) I am worthy of receiving its guidance and support. I am embracing the flow of divine wisdom into my life. (sighs) Underarm. I'm releasing any self-doubt and embracing my innate intuition. (sighs) Top of head. I gratefully and effortlessly access the wisdom of my higher self with all that I am and all that I am becoming. Stop tapping. Take a deep breath in. Release that breath slowly. 
Check in with how you're feeling. Assess your level of connection and openness to your higher self's wisdom. Repeat this process or continue tapping until you feel a sense of alignment and clarity. And, you know, feel free to change the words so that they resonate more with what you believe in and what your personal experience has been. Remember to approach this practice with self compassion it's so important with patience and trust in the process thank you so much for joining me today i'll be back again next week with another tap along sequence and on friday i'll be uploading a beauty product related video remember you are in perfect time see you soon